Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe, turn on your post notifications so that way you get notified every time I post a new video. For this week's video, I'm going to be doing Get Ready With Me and you'll find out also why I didn't go to college or what I'm gonna do. So let's get started. So I already moisturized my face and the next thing I do is my eyebrows. So I'm going to be using my Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz in the shade Dark Brown. So what I always do is I comb first. And they're already like kind of combed. But I didn't comb them. They're just like that. And yeah, I always start from the bottom. And I just go, you know, like basically follow the shape. So we got under, and then I'm going to do the top, and to me if it's too like thick or whatever, I'll conceal it, so then it'll be different, so that's that, and then I comb it to like kind of blend it. Okay, so... I already did my eyebrows but I haven't concealed them so don't look at them too closely. So I'm going to get my concealer and I've been using this concealer for the longest time and it's LA Girl Pro Concealer or Pro Conceal sorry. And I use the shade Creamy Beige during spring and summer and then this is my winter one and it's natural. So what I do is I always like push it out a little bit and I'm running out. So then I get like that much out and then I always put it like on the side right here. What I do is I take most of it off and then I just conceal under my eyebrow like that. So now I'm going to just do the rest. Okay, so now that I have my eyebrows concealed, I'm going to blend and just like blend the bottom one like towards my eyelid and obviously up a little bit but not too much because I don't want it to get on the eyebrow. So I just go ahead and do that. And I always start with the bottom first because, I don't know, if I mess up the top after, it's just like, okay, I know the bottom's okay, I just have to fix the top. But if I do the bottom and the bottom messes up, then it changes the whole like game to me. So I use NARS and in the shade medium 1.5. And what I basically do for this is I cover like the little blemishes I have. to be using my foundation and I use the CoverGirl Clean Matte BB Cream. I used to wear foundation but I don't know. I started working and where I work it's extremely hot and just wearing this alone makes my face like melt. So I don't wear foundation for that reason so I started wearing this. Oh and I'm the shade medium. So so I just pour some on my face. I don't know how much I use. I just, I don't know. I've always done this. And it seems easier for me. So, that much, I guess. So, that's my foundation. So next, I'm going to be using my Jeffree Star Setting Spray. It smells so good. It smells like strawberries. Like, I honestly recommend getting this setting spray. I feel like scents. And I don't really like scents, but that one's good as strawberry. So, anyways, I'm gonna let this dry a little. Next, I'm gonna use my powder, and it's the CoverGirl Clean Matte Powder. And it's it goes with this. Oh, it's medium too. What I like to do is I always apply, like, under my eyes first. And, um, so, 
I'm going to put this on. I'm going to try to hurry because I don't want to make this like a long video. Because my last one was long. Okay, so next I'm going to be bronzing. And I use my Hoola Benefit. Mine is a mini because, well, first of all, I've had this for like, I don't know, not that long. But I chose the mini because I didn't know if I was going to like it. So yeah, I'm going to take my brush and I'm just going to, you know, bronze. I'm going to do a regular one. So I'm going to use this one. I do not have the names I used to, but I use this palette too much and then I lost the names. So anyways, I'm going to go up here. And I'm not a beauty guru, so I do not know what a peer is. This one is NARS and it's Climax Mascara and it's shade black. So I'm just gonna, you know, put some mascara or whatever. I'm just gonna put a little lip gloss, whatever. And I'm going to be using the gloss by Jeffree Star in the shade legends only by the way i got this from my valentine's day mystery box and let me tell you it was my first time one ordering one ordering from him i think no, i'm just kidding i ordered this shane dawson palette the mini conspiracy but this is my second time but this is my first time ordering a mystery box and let me tell you he did not disappoint like i loved it so anyways, I'm gonna just, you know, uh, apply that. Okay, so I would say this look is done. So, so now let me just talk about my whole college dealio. So, before I start with this whole thing again, I just want to say I'm not advocating to not go to college. I'm just saying, like, my experience why I didn't go. So, yeah. So, I didn't go to college because one, I didn't want to waste money. Two, I didn't want to, like, change my major in, like, months or maybe a year, whatever. I just wanted to think about what I wanted to do make sure it was what I wanted to do, and then go for it. So, when I told my family I was not going to go to college, of course, there was people who were like, why? You're going to ruin your life. This and that. I'm like, I get it. But one, it's my life. I'm going to do what I want. Whether you think it's good or not but it's always for the best people make decisions for the best of them not for the worst so my decision was i was oh, in a year or two so i didn't say i wasn't going i just said i wasn't going now and to some people it just like triggered them like no you need to go and they would just like 
people would send me things not just a specific person but like many people like sometimes it was my family sometimes it was my friends but it was mostly my family because you know your family wants the best for you and i totally get that but it's also for the best of me and that's what i did i chose for me so yeah it was kind of uh, it was kind of weird it felt like disappointing because i wasn't going but then the other part of me was like you want to disappoint people even more when you decide you want to change it or like drop out but i didn't want to drop out i know you can always go do it again but i don't want to do that i just want to stick to one thing and be happy so i do definitely want to do either makeup culinary or baking so those are my three things i'm deciding still I'm leaning towards baking more because I just see these cakes or cupcakes, or cake pops, whatever, and they're so creative and I have like so much creativity that I like to show, so maybe baking, makeup, I want to do it, thing is, I don't ever want to mess up someone's makeup or disappoint a look, so not sure about that yet, and then culinary, Culinary has always had my heart. Like, I know the five mother sauces. I know, like, all those things. I watch baking shows, cooking shows, chopped, everything, you name it. And I just love it. So, we'll see with that. Um, so, school-wise, I was going to go to Cyprus. But I want to see still. I might go to Cyprus later on or I just might do like a academy, an academy. So we'll see with that. Um, yeah, so I'm sorry. I keep looking at like myself in the camera because I'm not sure how I like it. Like I keep looking in the mirror and I'm like, wow, it's actually pretty good. And I look on the camera, I'm like, wow, why doesn't it show like that in the mirror? So, sorry. Um, I don't know. College just wasn't for me right now. I do plan to go. I do think about like being a cop one day, like my boyfriend said. But I don't want to do something. I, I don't know. Okay, first reason I don't want to be a cop is... I don't want to get taste or pepper spray. Like I know it's just like a second thing, so you know what it feels like if it happens. But I can't do it. Like okay, honestly, I can barely go to the doctors and get a shot. Like how embarrassing is that? Like I can't. I'm just like really scared of needles. So yeah. So that is it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Comment any questions you have if you have any, and I'll answer them. In any of my videos and make sure you subscribe because I noticed 80% of you are not subscribed and what are you doing if you're not subscribed to my channel <laughs> nothing so it's easy as one to subscribe so see you guys next time